Hello, I'm Tanya Kirkland. I'm the 4-H Foundation Regional Extension Agent for Henry County. Hey, my name is Megan Jones and I'm the 4-H Agent Assistant for Henry County. First, you will take your pollutants and add them to the clean water. The confetti represents trash, grass, leaves, and any other debris. The soil represents soil and dirt. Vinegar represents fertilizers, pesticides, paint, and any other chemical runoff. And lastly, Vegetable oil represents motor oil from cars or oil that has run off from parking lots. The first filter we are using is the cheesecloth. How much of the pollutants do you think will be filtered out of the clean water? First, you will take your cup of plain water and add the confetti to it, which represents trash, such as grass and leaves. Second, you will add soil to it. This represents the soil and the dirt of the earth. Third, you will add vinegar. This represents chemical runoff, such as fertilizers, pesticides, and even paint. Last, we will add vegetable oil. Vegetable oil represents motor oil from cars or oil that has run off from parking lots. This time we are gonna use a coffee filter. So place your coffee filter over into your drainer and then put it into the bowl. Now let's pour the polluted water over the coffee filter and let's see how much this filter will filter out the pollutants. How do you think the polluted water will look now? As you can see, it is very hard to clean polluted water. Therefore, it is important that we do not pollute our water supply. Which filter do you think clean the polluted water the best? 